Just a quick one then, just got the stove out, you can see the hole where it was. Needs a bit of a clean in there, so it's about time I took it out. Um, but I had to do it because it's the, the oven burner that's gone. Um, normally it's the ones in the hob that get blocked and, and what I'm doing here is just taking out the, the jet. It's always the jets that are the problem and they, uh, they just start to get a little bit furred up inside and they need to have uh, a little bit of a clean out. These, this one obviously is very difficult to get to so I have to actually take the whole burner assembly off and take the jet out and once I've got that then I can, uh, I can clean it. So what I do to do that is to use one of these things here. So this is uh, uh, one of the little dental floss type things uh, and it's just quite good because you can just get it in and wiggle it around give it a good clean inside there that's basically all it needs it's it's, it's they're pretty foolproof these things it's just almost always the thing that goes wrong so it's the first thing to look for usually gives you a warning because the uh, the flame just goes low and erratic um, and yeah that's when it's time for a clean I should have done this one a couple of days ago because it I, th I knew it was getting a bit low and then last night it really struggled I just put the broiler plate on top to get the oven up to temperature uh, to cook our dinner uh, but hopefully this should do it.